For more than a decade, Ken Miyagashima has served the city of Las Cruces as its mayor. And after last night, he'll be serving yet another term. KTSM 9 News reporter Selena Quintana live in the newsroom with more. This was the first year Las Cruces implemented ranked choice voting in their system, and Miyagashima won 55% of the, of the instant runoff vote. Three full terms marking 12 years so far as Las Cruces mayor for Ken Miyagashima. After Tuesday's election, he'll add another four. Miyagashima tells me he keeps running for the love of his city. And I really enjoy being able to help and deal with our, our community, our, our citizens, our residents. You know, because they have, they have concerns, they need some assistance, and if I can provide it, why not? Miyagashima says he has big plans for the city of Crosses. Uh, there's an area called the Amador Proximo that I'd like to maybe replicate something that I saw in Albuquerque uh, several months ago. Uh, they, they call it the Sawmill District. Uh, I guess we could call ours the Cotton Gin District, uh, and it basically would be a mixture of affordable housing, uh, commercial development. Something he says could bring 1,000 jobs to the city. Other plans include revitalizing the El Paseo shopping district and even turning Las Cruces Burn Lake into a beachfront park. Some residents tell me he's done a great job. He has done very good for the community, and hopefully it will be given the chance to re-elect him again and again. Others ready to move on. That, that seems excessive. And there was a lot of other really great candidates, but congratulations to him. But I do think that candidates should only have two terms. Tells me that this was the most expensive campaign he's ever done so far, but he's grateful for his team and the support he got from the community and volunteers. Reporting in the newsroom, Selena Quintana, KTSM 9 News. All right, Selena, thank you very much.